Today I'm going to be talking about Samsung Pay, a recently launched payment service in India. Cashless transactions and payment wallets have become an integral part of our life and the recent demonetization action actually gave momentum to the rising number of e-wallets and digital payment solutions. You might have heard about Apple Pay and even Android Pay. Well, if you didn't know, Samsung had its own mobile solution too and Samsung calls it Samsung Pay. Android Pay and Apple Pay work on the technology called NFC which stands for Near Field Communication. Samsung Pay uses NFC and also another alternative technology called MST which is the technology which separates it and distinguishes it from its rivals. So MST implies that Samsung Pay is compatible with almost any point of sale machine throughout India or even the world which allows you to swipe a card. It is truly backward compatible. Samsung Pay is compatible with debit and credit cards of the MasterCard and Visa technologies of HDFC, Axis Bank, ICICI, SBI and Standard Chartered Bank so far and support for American Express will be added very shortly. It also supports Paytm so you can ditch the Paytm app and pay and make transactions from Samsung Pay itself. Samsung Pay support starts from Galaxy S6, S6 Edge, S6 Edge Plus the S7, S7 Edge, the Note 5 and the new 2017 devices A5 and A7 have the compatibility so far and I'm pretty sure Samsung will be launching new devices with new hardware that will support Samsung Pay very soon. So far I've performed 4 to 5 transactions using Samsung Pay and I have a strike rate of 100. the new service there are a few hiccups. Uh, one of them being the shopkeeper does not know what Samsung Pay is. He's very skeptical to hand you the device when you ask for the credit card machine. The second thing is, he's convinced that the payment is not going to work. He's like, ye nahi chalta yaar bhai, ye bhaiya ye nahi chalta, ye aisa nahi rehta. Some shopkeepers are actually open, they are actually interested. And as the Samsung branding sales, your cashier might be impressed and I've actually seen that happen. Standard joints like Subway and KFC and it has worked. I've also tried it at a local grocery store which accepts credit cards and it worked there too. Samsung Pay does not work when the battery is very low. I'm guessing below 5% because I was using it when my battery was 1% and it didn't allow me to make the transaction. The user interface is very simple and you have the option of jumping into Samsung Pay from any screen including the lock screen. Consumers might consider using Samsung Pay. The common question that might come up is, is it safe? The answer to that is yes, it is safe. The technologies that it's using, that is NFC, is worldwide used for making payments by even companies like Apple and the MST technology, I could say it's as safe as swiping your credit card. Actually go a step ahead and call using Samsung Pay safer than actually swiping your credit card because Samsung Pay uses two technologies. It uses digital tokenization where each transaction has a unique four-digit code that the device generates. Samsung Pay stores your card information on a very secure element on the phone and no data is synced or stored on the cloud. Some of the features that are yet to come are support for gift cards and store cards which will soon be added as Samsung gains customers. So how has Samsung Pay helped me ever since its launch two weeks back? Well, I've been able to keep my wallet at home and pay only using my phone and with my fingerprint. The image of the system is the Samsung Pay app allows me to not carry my card but it makes me put my PIN and I guess that is a current protocol that our Indian banks are following. Part of this video would not have been possible without the help of my dear friends Ashutosh, Chaitanya and Apurva who helped me film me paying for the KFC bill using Samsung Pay. Hey you, I took a quick shower with my Galaxy S7 and my phone is fine, working perfectly though the camera stopped recording when I put it in the sink, I had the tap on. You say the Galaxy S7 is indeed water resistant. Sorry, what a proof. If you have a phone that supports Samsung Pay, are you going to be using it?